What up, folks? It's Wiley Warlock, and we are back for some more The Witcher 3. What's next on our list? We got word where Jennifer was. So we're going to go check that out. Call my horse. You're not walking anywhere. Makes no sense. Slow now. Whoa. Fucking way. It's all good though. But his legs though. Jerk off is pretty uh Gerald. I call him Jerk Off. What the fuck is his name? Pretty badass though. I like ya. <coughs> I don't know why I took that rusty sword. I don't really need that. There's something else over here.
gotta find a way to get down here. Not that way. Alright, it worked out. that noise sensors aren't picking up anything is that a glitch I'm all out. Come on, man. Why couldn't I run? Be faster. Stay here. There you go. There we go. That dude was tough. Yo, I chopped one dude in half, though. That shit was crazy. Like, that's a dude. this shit. Get out the rain here. Empty bottles probably with that. Maybe I'll be, you know.
scavenger hunt. Viper school here. Okay. Viper school. Need to figure out where I can stir up some potions. <laughs> Something else you'll be needing. Got anything interesting under the counter? Depends what you're after. Have a look. Nothing. Farewell. Uh. Come to Pappy. I don't like the look of these dudes. Come to Pappy! Yennefer's in Vizima. Got a few friends there, so... Something wrong? Look around. Trouble brewing. Time, time we were on our way. Mm-hmm. I'll buy some provisions for the journey. Then we'll go. Geralt, we should stay out of it. Just this once. No, we can't do that. What happened to the lilies? Took them down. Took him down to hang a golden sun there now. I cannot show to Marian colors. They'll come and burn the tavern down. Maybe it's true what they say. You fund of the Imperials. You Nilfgaard's whore. I'll let that pass. I know grief eats at your heart. You know shit. Uh oh. Fight. They hang my sister, dragged her out the cloister like a dog. Said Nilfgaard's no place for superstition, that they don't fear the wrath of the gods. And you, do you fear it? If not for Annie, your child would have choked on its navel string. You owe your son to Let's my son attending to the birth, and you don't fear the gods' wrath. You don't fear it, you cunt! Oh, shit. Leave me be! Recognize this medallion? You know what it means. Back off. You all right? They say witches steal young'uns. That's true. What the Emperor promise you freaks? Your own land? Like he did the elves once? Get out, all of you. Oh, we ain't they, going nowhere. Oh, and they, neither they bring it are you. Now? They won't back down now. I can see that.
Yo, I thought I'd pass the shit. <laughs> See his face! God save us! Be gone, and don't ever come back! So much for not getting involved. Come on, let's go. That brawl? We didn't start it. Holy shit. Excuses, excuses. You've not changed a bit. Y Yen? How? I received a report about a witcher who'd appeared in White Orchard. I knew it was you, looking for me. I might have waited until you found me, but... Well, you know me. Patience has never been my strong suit. It's... Good to see you, Geralt. I... I'd even embrace you. Were you not covered in blood? Sorry. Wasn't expecting to see you. To be honest, this isn't at all how I imagined we'd meet. How did you imagine it? You didn't imagine you'd have a Nilfgaardian escort. Don't get me wrong, Yennefer. I'm glad to see you. But I do think you owe us an explanation. And I shall provide it. In Vizima. Ready your horses. Ready the horses. Spent the last six months in the saddle. Haven't seen you for two years. Can't we take a moment to... Sadly, we cannot. Someone awaits you, Geralt. Someone who doesn't like to be kept waiting. Emperor Emir Var Emrys. Or, to those on more intimate terms with him, the white flame dancing on the graves of his foes. Doubt I number among that group. For as I remember, last time we saw each other, he wanted to kill me. Well, now he wishes to make you an offer. The kind one can't refuse? I didn't, though I could have. Fine. Guess I'm willing to hear him out. The Emperor of Nilfgaard, Lord of Metina, Ebbing, and Gamera, Sovereign of Nazare and Vicovaro, will feel honored, I'm sure. What about you? I'm going in the opposite direction. I somehow doubt the Emperor's invitation mentioned me. Besides, I've got things to do at Kaer Morhen, remember? Yeah, I remember. Thanks for your help, Vesemir. See you soon. This is where we park ways. How's your horse? Swift? Can't complain. Why do you ask? I'd like to be back behind some thick city walls as soon as possible. Let's ride. Right now! How is 
this? tomorrow all right after the audience Ooh. things is heating up this bard's tale begins near white orchard with my dear friend Geralt of Rivia seeking his lover of yore the sorceress Yennefer she'd eluded him for years but now seemed just a few steps ahead after many trials and tribulations, Geralt finally learned that Yen was in nearby Vizima. It must suffice. Think of your cares if I'm clean. The gentleman will refer to his Imperial Majesty by his full title or not at all. The gentleman will be seated on the berger. The what now? In that uh, chair. Catwin, please shave the gentleman's sideburns to half an inch. What's wrong with my beard? Always thought it added to my dignity. It does. Yet it also detracts from your elegance. In Nilfgaard, we consider beards hard on the eyes. Especially beards infested with lice. Been on the road a while. Fine. Do your thing. Tilt your head back, please. And sit still. Ugh. Joel, you nasty. And prepare to answer some questions. General, I, I am not certain this is the appropriate time. I can't think of a better time. Men turn honest when they feel a blade at their throat. Movran Vuris, commander of the Alba Division. Before they take you in to see the Emperor, Witcher, there's some information I need you to verify. It's a formality. But one that must be seen to. Sure. Paperwork's gotta be in order. So, Geralt of Rivia. Place of birth unknown. Parents unknown. Age unknown. All insignificant details. Let us proceed to more recent events. The siege of La Valette Castle. The fate of the defending commander one Arya. Voltest ordered me to clear the path. The boy stood in my way. Cutting down the Lavalette air. This made no impression on you? Uh, I suppose it wouldn't. What's some baron to you? An assassin of kings? Moving on. You then found shelter in charming Flotsa, and from there made your way to Virgo. My question is how?
I don't know what any of this is doing. I left Flotsam with Yorvith, commander of a Squiatel unit. A slayer of monsters and a slayer of men. You forge interesting alliances. Something tells me my most interesting is yet to come. Go on, next question, before my beard grows back in. We shall shave you again if it does. <sighs> Very well. The infamous summit at Loch Mui. You were there. And once again meddled in the affairs of the mighty. The mighty had imprisoned Triss Marigold. Ought to know I care about her. And I tend to rescue those I care about. And so you did, handing Radovid control of the Conclave and Council of Mages in the process. Nilfgaard recently started a war, unprovoked. So do us both a favor and stop moralizing. The gentleman must sit still. I'm almost done. I'm afraid I might find that difficult. Because, from what I know, shortly afterwards you watched a defective megascope blow your friend Sheila de Tatsaville to bits. I watched her get in the megascope, but ultimately freed her from the trap your man Letho of Gullet had set. Write that down. I want to be sure the paperwork's in order now. Well, national interest calls on one to forge difficult alliances at times. Alliances with witches included. Well, that alliance has been dissolved, irrevocably. I killed Letho in Loch Muin. So we heard. It's a good thing you did. Saved our agents some messy and difficult work. I believe that is all. Your signature, please, affirming you stated the whole truth and nothing but the truth on pain of imprisonment or death, etc., etc. Here, um, <laughs> here. With these formalities seen to, I would ask the general to leave the room. We shall be choosing the gentleman's attire. An important matter, but one that does not require the general's assistance. Shame. I might have given you some advice. So long, Garrett. Good luck with your audience. Feels more like I'm being readied for a wedding. Were that so, I would have prepared the gentleman a frock, a tailcoat, or possibly a dinner jacket. In point of fact, the gentleman will choose from these garments. Where is my clothes? Where are my clothes? <laughs> Where they should have gone long ago, with the laundress. They will be returned to you after the audience, clean and starched. The gentleman will tell me once he has chosen an outfit. All this fancy shit, man. I'm gonna go with this shit. Oh, I can you're picking shoes? All the same shit though. This might come as news to the gentleman, but the towel wrapped around one's waist is not fitting attire for an audience. Oh, Jeff I gotta put it on myself. Dress.
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>